heavy, heavy movement and pounding the zone, trusting defense, guys making some plays behind him. But um, you know, the um, use some changeups, not a lot of them, but enough, I think, to even make the fastball a little bit more effective at times. But um, he just he just controlled with heavy movement, and it's just. Um, that guy's been a pleasure to watch this year and the way he goes about his business, the way he continues to try and add pitches to his arsenal um, and the way he competes. That was, a, that was just a great finish to a very good season, abbreviated nonetheless, but great season. Kind of one of those baseball oddities too. Like he only gave up one earned run at home. I think his ERA was 0 0.27. Uh, I guess he likes this mound uh, more than the other ones. I think he likes Kaufman too, and um, yeah, you know, I, I, there's something to be said about a, a place where you feel good on the mound. Um, you know, if you make your pitches, you know, he's a ground ball guy too. I mean, he's going to get you some ground balls, and if he makes mistakes, uh, you're not going to have cheap hits get out of this ballpark. You can trust your defense, and that's it's easy to say. And then you go into some of these ballparks, and guys are miss hitting balls that are going out of the park. Um, it makes them almost try and do too much, you know, but. You know, Kaufman's a very fair park, and it's uh, playing really well for Brad. And Mondi, offensively, um, you got to like the way he's finishing this season so strong. Oh, it's incredible. And just what he does, you know, we were just talking with the coaches. Um, when he hits the ball, especially like, like he did down the right field line, you see the entire dugout stand up to watch this guy run. Um, just the, the movement. Uh, that, that he make he makes all over the field, whether it's defensively and especially once he starts running, um, getting the bunt down, putting pressure on. We talked about that early on, just doing some of those little things, and then he was going to find a groove. And he's in such a nice place right now. I don't want to, and he doesn't probably want to stop playing either, because this is, you know, once again, you take the bigger picture of this. You know, we're just getting started in the summer months right now, where he would be kind of getting on that roll to take off. And I don't believe I believe there wouldn't be any turning back, but. We've also talked about how this is a, a great year for him to grow and develop from the adversity that he had to go through because it it was a, it was a lot he was putting on himself that was coming on him and he uh, figured out a way to get into a good place and um, yeah if you're not excited watching this guy play then uh, I don't know what you're looking for.